Praise the Lord. God bless you. Thank you very much. God bless you. Today, uh, God bless you. God bless you. Uh, you know that one. We are today we are preaching the gospel uh, in London Christian Bible Way Pentecostal Church. Praise the Lord. Pastor Wilson is here. Reverend Wilson, uh, Reverend Tony is here. We are here. All the church members we are preaching gospel. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now it's a question. This is Citizen Day. Preaching the gospel to everybody. People are watching online. Share this gospel message to everybody. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So, we are praying one minute to everybody right now. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, we are starting to preach this gospel right now. Thank you for attaching lots of souls, giving and anointing a power to each and every people. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. 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 So, Pastor Tony will be preaching in the 20 minute time like that. Pastor Reverend will be preaching. I will be preaching. And we all are preaching. And uh, souls are coming to the heaven soon. Praise the Lord. Am I right? <laughs> Praise brother. Thank you. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Greetings to you once again in the name of Jesus. Here we are at Brixton Station to preach the gospel because the Bible says that this gospel has to be preached before the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. Anytime from now Jesus is coming. The question is, are you ready? Are you ready, my brother, my sister? Because Jesus is coming anytime. The question is, are you ready when Jesus comes? Come today. Jesus is calling by name. Don't think of tomorrow, because tomorrow we do not know whether we are going to wake up from a bed. But come today, Jesus is calling you by name. Jesus loves you very much. No one can love like how Jesus loves you. That's what the Bible says, for God so loved the world, that he gave his begotten son, that whoever believes shall not perish, but have life eternal. The world can promise you many things in this world. But one thing you need to understand, Jesus has promised you life eternal. Because the world in which you and I are living, we are living in a temporary world. The body in which you are living is a temporary body. One day you will die and that's what's happening. Come, today when you die, do you know where you go? Where you go, do you know when you, where you die? There are two places that the Bible speaks. One is called heaven and one is called hell. You may say, oh, I don't believe in such a place like that. You said, God is loving. Will God send me over there? My brother and sister, if you don't believe in Jesus Christ, you will make it to hell. And the Bible says it's not the will of God that any soul perish. Because you and I, we are made in the image and in the likeness of God. Heaven was made for you and for me. But whereas hell was made for Satan and his fallen angels. And how can you make it to heaven? By confessing your sins and believing in the name of Jesus Christ. Because only Jesus is the way, the life and the truth. There is no other way, there is no other shortcut. You may be the most richest person. You may have five buildings, you may have five cars. But your money cannot take you to heaven. Your money cannot promise you to heaven. Come, only Jesus can take you to heaven. That's why Jesus Christ died for your sins and is coming back soon for everyone. You will stand before the judgment seat. Come today. Repent of your sins and turn back to God. For God is loving. God loves you very much. Because everyone over here is a sinner. The Bible says for all the sin and fall shortage of the glory of God. No one is righteous. There is none that is righteous. There is none that is holy. Come today. God loves you. He doesn't want you to die in your sin. Life is not sure. Life is not guaranteed. Any time from now, anything can happen. You may be young, you may be old, you may be healthy, you may be strong, you may go to the gym. But one thing you need to understand, you can die any time from now. You can die today, you can die tomorrow, you can die while you are sleeping. You can meet up with an accident or you can be killed. Life is not guaranteed. Come today. Because wherever we see, there is always bad news. Wherever we watch in the television, there is always bad news. You watch in the internet, there is only bad news. But there is also good news. And the good news is that Jesus Christ loves you. The good news is that Jesus Christ came for you. The good news is that Jesus wants to take you to heaven. 
come today repent of all your sins and turn back to god god is forgiving god is merciful and god loves you more than anyone can love you the bible says you have loved you with an everlasting love and jesus christ is coming back no one else is going to come back no one has said that they're coming back only jesus i made an open declaration that is coming back all the prophets all the kings all the prime ministers all the presidents of any country they never said that they're coming back but jesus christ declared that he is coming back to judge the living and the dead he is coming for you he is coming for me he is not coming for a religion he is coming for you and me because religion will not take you to heaven relationship with jesus christ will take you to heaven he is looking for a relationship like a father and a son like a father and a daughter and that's where jesus christ uh, has promised you a place come today don't think of tomorrow because tomorrow is not guarantee you not guarantee that tomorrow you are going to live you not guarantee that what is going to happen come today jesus is calling you by name jesus loves you my brother my sister when you die are you sure you are going to make it to heaven when you die are you sure you are going to make it to heaven if you are not sure come today to jesus christ jesus is calling you jesus is calling you my brother my sister come today do not ignore this message do not ignore the call of god because jesus christ loves you and he doesn't want your soul to perish the bible says what a man if he profit he gains the whole world or what a man can give in exchange of his soul come today jesus loves you jesus is concerned over your soul come today my brother my sister do not delay today is the day of salvation the choice you make uh, determines whether you are going to heaven or whether you are going to hell today you say oh i don't believe in hell you say oh there is no place like that called hell but when you die Five. and when you Five. land up over there Five. Five. when Five. you land up there you know 6 9 9 6 when you land up over there then you will understand my brother my sister it is not the will of god for you to land up in hell fire because the devil is deceiving you the devil is telling that you don't need god but there is a god who made the heaven and the earth there is a god who has created you in the womb of your mother you have not been created by science god created you the bible says god breathed his spirit in man and man became a living being and that's where you need god in your life my brother my sister come today you may say oh i don't need god without god you will die in your sin and you will land up in hell fire you will be burning up like a barbecue roasted by the devil if you want to be roasted by the devil then you can deny jesus but if you want to go to heaven believe in the name of jesus christ because jesus christ came for everyone jesus christ came for you he came for me no matter for which country you are no matter what religion you follow the good news is that jesus christ came for everyone and he died for your sin and he died for my sin and he's coming back very soon are you ready are you ready my brother my sister the question is are you ready are you ready for heaven if you die tonight if you die now are you sure you're going to make it to heaven if you're not sure then you are confused you need to come today come now this is the day of salvation come today make a decision the choice you make today will determine you whether you are going to heaven or whether you will make it to hell come today my brother my sister come because jesus christ is the way the life and the truth there is no other way there is no other shortcut jesus christ is not one of the way but he is the way because your money cannot take you to heaven your business cannot take you to heaven by doing a lot of charity does not take you to heaven by praying five times uh, does not take you to heaven only jesus can take you to heaven why only jesus because only jesus christ died for your sin no one has died for your sins my brother my sister your boyfriend did not die for you your girlfriend did not die for you your partner did not die for you the devil did not die for you it's only jesus christ died for you and was crucified on the cross of calvary he shed his precious blood and is coming back for you and for me 
come today, my brother, my sister. Do not delay in coming to Jesus. He is looking at you. He is knocking at the door of your heart. He is knocking at the door of your heart. Will you invite Jesus Christ into your heart? Will you give your heart to Jesus? Will you make Jesus Christ as your personal Savior? Because Jesus Christ is the Savior, He is the Messiah, and He is the soon coming King. Because Jesus Christ came to save and seek the lost. He came for you and for me. Because we are living in a dying world. We are living in an evil world. We are living in a wicked world. Wherever you see there is darkness. Come today my brother my sister. Come away from your sin. Come away from your sin. If you are robbing, stop robbing. If you are lying, stop lying up. If you are cheating, stop cheating up. Come today. If you are having sex before marriage, that is sin, my brother. If you are committing adultery, come back to God. Because God is holy. God is holy. Come back today, my brother, my sister. Come. Jesus will accept you the way you are. Because Jesus Christ came for sinners like you and me. For all the sin and fall shortage of the glory of God. Come today. Jesus is calling in my name. The choice you make today, the choice you make today will determine that after you die, whether you will make it to heaven or whether you will make it to hell. Come today, my brother, my sister, because salvation is free. It is not sold in the market. It is not purchased in the market. It is given free to everyone because the greatest miracle is salvation. Without Jesus Christ, you will die in your sin. Without Jesus Christ, you will land up in hell fire. Come today. God has promised you a place called heaven. Heaven is a beautiful place, my brother, my sister. And how can you make it to heaven now? By confessing your sin and believing in the name of Jesus Christ. You can make it to heaven. There is no other way. There is no other shortcut. You don't make it to heaven now by killing people. By killing people. By stabbing people. You don't make it to heaven. There is only one way which you can make it to heaven. By confessing your sin and believing in the name of Jesus. Because Jesus is the Savior, He is the Messiah. Come today, my brother, my sister. I do not know from which country you are. It does not matter. Jesus Christ loves you. He looks at your heart. He looks at your heart. Come today. Come today. Repent and come back to God. He will change your heart. He will change everything. He can give you peace. If you, have, if you don't have peace, come to Jesus. You don't have to go to the pub. You don't go out to the club. You don't have to become a drug addict to have peace. Jesus can give you peace. Because the peace that you go by having up, by drinking in the pub or becoming alcoholic is only temporary. Come today. If you are depressed, come today. Jesus will give you peace. Come today, my brother. If you need healing, Jesus can heal you. Because Jesus Christ is the healer. He can heal you of any sickness. Heal you of any disease. Come today. God loves you very much. God loves everyone and He doesn't want your soul to perish, my brother. The choice you make today will determine whether you will make it to heaven or now. People in Brixton as they are preaching the gospel. Because the Bible says that this gospel has to be preached. We give glory to God. Amen. What's that? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So, Reverend Minister, thank you for the morning. Reverend Minister is preaching gospel once again. Praise the Lord.